it's time to do it. Let's get into Dungeon 4 and see if we can get this done. What's going on, everyone? It's Rich Haywood here from Bacon Ice Cream Productions and Team RTFC, welcoming you to yet another episode of Good Times with Retro Rich. We have made it successfully to yet another Master System Monday, and we're still playing some Golden Axe Warrior. But this time, hopefully, it'll be different when you use this trusty map. All right, we're going all the way to A1 yet again. And we're going to get in there, and we're going to take out Dungeon 4, which is sitting right here. The Island Palace will go down, hopefully today. We'll see. We're going to go in there, and we're going to we're going to see what we can see. If it doesn't work out, I get beat up too much. I have to burn my golden apple too early. You know, the, I don't know, whatever. All of those things could happen. Who knows? But uh, hopefully it'll be a good time, and we can get in there and get this done. So, I'm gonna hit this button here. Now I'm in. We're in the game. Let's switch out to the the overlay, I guess, and uh, and get this done. I don't know. It's a Monday. It's a Monday. I don't know what's going on today. All right. Good stuff. Good stuff. All right. Here we are. Let's check the inventory. Got a magic oil, got a golden apple. The golden apple is going to fill our life if we choose to use it, and the magic oil there uh, fills the magic when we when we burn that. But right now, all we need is our trusty sword, and we're going to get to um, Dungeon 4 right now. So we're at the desert uh, town. Here we are right here in the desert town. Uh, that's F5. I've basically got to go... Uh, down, uh, over one, up one, up two, over. Yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna make a run for it. So this is gonna be pretty simple. It's just run, 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 run straight to the dungeon. Try to pick up some bread on the way from the easy enemies. Once we get to the bridge that takes us to the bridge over at uh, C one, B one, and then B two, A two, A one. That run right there. Um, we're gonna see if we can pick up some stuff. But everybody else in our way, we're just basically booking past because it's a lot of enemies that could do a severe amount of damage um, if we don't, be, if we're not careful. So I'm not looking for anything else but to get through that door and get to uh, the dungeon. So let's go. Ah. Oh, get some bread there. Okay. So over here, we got to run this way. We're running. I think what we're going to do is we're actually going to run up this way to see if we can get that spawn. Hoo, hoo, hoo. That was close. That was close. We've made it almost there. Ah. All right. So maybe we can take these guys out. I need bread here. No bread. All right. Here we go again. We've got some more of these guys. Oh. That's a it's a little bit of a rough of a rough uh, thing here. Maybe this guy will have meat. I got some bread to get some life back. This is not the this is not it was one was not the run I wanted uh, to get to here. So we'll see. Uh, taking way too much damage. Got some bread there. All right. So, uh, without that, without that hit ooh, another bread. All right. Cool. And some horns. So we're not in terrible shape right now let's see let's see if these guys got some bread for me so getting into the dungeon we are almost full all right so we're gonna get back in here though uh we are made made it officially into dungeon four um with just a little under um full life you know like a heart and a little little chunk 
Um, but now we got to get into business, into the into the supreme business. Now, what we need to do now is go one over and I think two up. We need to get to the warp that will bring us to uh, the, the last part of the dungeon. The warp that we need is all the way in um, D3, if I'm not mistaken. It is. Um, so according to the map, we start down here at A8. All right, we got to get all the way up to here where my middle finger is here uh, at D3. So that's that's a long way to go. We already have the canoe so we can get through uh, certain aspects of the uh, the map without having to continue too much further. Let me check our, we got one key. Um, and I actually technically already have the map unlocked because uh, again, we've been through, uh, we've been through this stuff. So um, let's see what we got as we go through. I mean, all the enemies of course um, would would have respawned, um, so they're gonna be they're still gonna be here. Some of the enemies are not, uh, you know, too too na too nasty. We got these skeleton guys here, um, and look, we're almost ar already at full health, so um, it's not too too bad. Um, there we go, and we're at full health, which is awesome. There we go. Uh, full health, full stuff. We're we're not doing so bad here, and it even uh, it even remembered all the openings um, where I was going to have to use magic here before. I don't have to. Um, we'll uh, we'll just switch back here. Oh, I don't know what that is, but that thing doesn't seem friendly at all. Why? What? What is happening? I don't even know what those enemies are, but I'm out of here. All right. Hopefully that won't be too much of a problem when we get out of this. Uh, when we get out of this dungeon. Hopefully we can just run past them. All right. All right. Ah. Oh my goodness. Those enemies are no joke. Taking us right out. Oh, more of these guys. Oh, serious? I'm out of here. What are these things? That's crazy. Oh, my goodness. Oh. There it is. That's a That's a game over right there. Um, I do have a uh, magic oil, so we're gonna have to we're gonna hit continue and we're gonna see. I know it's only three uh, three hearts. Let's see if I can get through here. No, I don't think so. Yeah, and even with the thunder magic, I don't think that's gonna help us out. Let's go through. We cleared most of these rooms, so we should be able to just run straight through. Except for this room here. Man. Alright. Nice. Alright, so that should be okay. Ah. Oh man. I was hoping for some bread. Alright, so this guy. We're at, yeah, this is A3. This is where you get the canoe in here. Um, so we don't have to worry about that room anymore. Um, we got to go through here. We're actually going to go up this time. Uh, this is where it's just a, a key, I think. All right. Oh, this thing's taking my coins. There's some bread. All right, so we're back to three hearts. That's fine. Ah. All right, got some there. All right, I think this is where the canoe is, actually. 
Oh my goodness gracious. Nothing there. And then this goes to the warp, which is right here. Oh, with another one of these guys? Are you serious right now? Ah. Uh. All right. So we, we've cleared the path. This one's a rough one. We've cleared the path to the uh, to the dungeon. Or to the warp, I think. We can get there mostly. All right. Cleared this room. This room we ran past. Do a little duck and run. So I'm not messing with those things that just like disappear and reappear. I'm, I'm just not even... I'm not even trying about that. All right. Um, oh my goodness, this guy's all over me. Because this guy could kill me in one hit. There we go. Got him. All right, so these guys here. All right, at least we got something there. Um, so we've got to go do the magic, earth magic. All right, we got that opened. Boom. All right, we've got the warp done. Now, the warp has taken us to C3, or C2, I should say, where A1 is where the boss is. Um, so I should be able to just move to the left um, twice and up one, and then the boss is right there. There's nothing else really. What's well, so D1? Doesn't nothing else really has any? There's no extra stuff. There's no extra weapons or whatever. It's just basically survive. So I'm just gonna go for it and hopefully pick up some something. You know, like I need some kind of uh, some kind of health. Give me, give me some, give me some bread. Give me something here. And this is a this is a, a room clear um, objective point, so I have to clear the room in order for the door to open. So there we go. But I got nothing, nothing. All right. This is another room clear. Ah, didn't mean to do that. Oh my goodness gracious. This is rough. This is a rough one. I mean, because again, you don't want to use the golden apple too early. You're going to, I'm going to need it for the boss fight. I, mean, I know I'm going to need it for the boss fight. Um, and that magic, I can't, I can't. I've used all the magic that I need right now to get to where I need to be. So I'm not worried about using it using it up right now that's not a that's not a problem it's just that oh my goodness that room's gonna be full now too it's too many too many rooms are respawning because I had to continue too many times all right got that. All right, no, still no hearts. It's rough, rough going. Um, there's no, there's no better way to do this. You just got to get through this, and it's a room clear, so I have no choice. I have to clear the room. Oops. Oh my goodness gracious. Wow. Maybe I have to use magic? I don't know. Because the axe probably isn't going to do anything. The The sword is stronger. So. <sighs> wow. Might as well just kill me. <laughs> so, oh my goodness gracious.
All right. Let me get through this. Let me try this again. I mean, I know. I know there is the ultimate pull, but I just don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Not to this game. It's been it's been so long. Man, man, this oh my god, this room two now. Uh, ow. Oh man. Yeah, you know, they're basically all gonna start respawning. I'm very frustrated. <laughs> See, so, you know, the problem is I don't want to get stuck, you know? Like, I could leave and then build up some more. Ooh, that's a good strategy right there. Some bread right there. Get this guy to come after me. All right. Oh, run. Run, run, okay, oh, these guys, oh, I got some magic, ah, some bread but i got hit at the same time all right so what if we just did this um you know what what if you know if I could hit him with the magic and then get out of there, you know, be able to, to get him on distance, you know, maybe some, oh my goodness. Nothing, no bread, nothing. I was hoping that maybe like I was gonna get one of these guys and they were gonna just drop some meat, you know, because that would be amazing. Instead, I just get wrecked. That was weird. All right, uh, what is up here? Maybe there's just some random enemies. I mean, they're they're not great. All right, got them. Oh yeah, there's some meat. And I immediately get hit. All right, so I picked up a key, so that was cool. What's in this room? Weird. Oh, no. <laughs> no thanks. No thanks to that room. I don't know what that is. And I have to beat everybody in this other room. Or the door won't open, so. All right. What? What the? Are you serious? Ah, uh, all right. Here we go again. Oh, uh, these guys respond. Mm. 
one piece of bread at least. These guys respawn again. Oh, come on. I'm just getting sloppy here. Alright. Run through here. Run through here. Run through here. No. Ouch. Oh! <laughs> oh, man. This is rough. These guys respawn again. Ugh. I don't even have enough even. Come on. Because again, I just want it just don't want to burn that apple. All right, I can get through here. Wow. Oof. I don't even. All right. I got through that. So at least they won't respawn when I come back. Because, I mean, there's no way I'm clearing this room on, what is it, a quarter of a heart? Unless I get some. Nope. <sighs> These guys again. <sighs> I take them out all carefully. I can't even get rewarded with like a meat or some bread or something. No, no guy, you get nothing. You get none of this. Oh, come on, these guys are back. Far for Knuken. Let's get under here. Here, this guy. Come here. Man, I got horns, so that's something. All right, cleared that room. This room's still clear. Take the warp. These guys are back. All right. So even the magic is is kind of janky. I wish this. I wish that level with that that had all those other guys with the shooting guys and all that. I wish that was this room. At least there's cover, right? I mean, you can get behind stuff. There's stuff getting behind in here. Don't don't get me wrong, but it's also like, come on. All right. So. Oh. Come on. Oh. These guys again. Come on, somebody drop me like a thing of meat so I can get six hearts so at least get through that room. Because if I can clear that room and then die again at the boss or something, maybe I can, I don't know, maybe I can get to the boss room without it. Come on, nothing? another one down that's another one down there we go lure you guys take that all right at least that door open so i think it's open now for forever because i've unlocked it 
Um, can I hit these guys through the through the, the thing? I think I can hit him with the axe. Maybe not. All right, how's that? Wow, I can't even hit those guys with the axe. Can I hit the bats with the something? They're not even coming close. They're they're over there though, so I can go this way. And then maybe get them over here. Oh, yeah. That's exactly what I'm looking for. All right. We might be able to get through this. Maybe. There we go. All right, cool. So this should be a straight run. Oh, all right. So now, here we go. We're going for the uh, regular magic and we're going to do the where is this guy this pattern that he's okay so I guess they only appear in certain he only appears certain ways. I wonder if I can wait for him enough. Will he appear in the middle again? It doesn't look like it. So basically, wherever he is, I gotta book it to the other side and then try to get him uh, with the magic on a on a uh, on a thing here. All right. Whoa. Okay. So now we got to use the oil. And why isn't it not letting me use the oil? Oh, crap. Why can't I use the oil? I'm supposed to be able to use the oil and get my magic back. Balls. All right. Well, guess it's uh this and the golden apple. I got to get in on them real quick as soon as he spawns before that thing comes out. Let's see if that's a thing. There we go. Oh, man. Got people calling me. Trying to get the trying to get the codec codes. All right. Let's see here. Oh. That was like one and a half or something when I hit him. Oh, it's no good. There we go. All right. Oh, yeah. I got him. Oh, that was like the roughest half hour I think I've ever had playing a game. Oh, my goodness. And I got the coin. <laughs> oh, man. Funny thing about work phones going off. Um, oh, wow. 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 All right. We got the crystal. 
Thull Life. Uh, now I've got eight hearts. I got full magic. I can book it out of here and get back to um, get back to the next thing. So let's go. Let's let's uh, let's hightail it out of here. Whoa! Almost ran straight into getting smacked. All right. Get out of here. All right. We go straight here. I'm wondering why I couldn't use that that magic oil. It's so weird. This was a straight over. No, this is straight down. It goes down here. Heck with you guys. I'm out of here. You guys can all hang out if you want, but me, I'm headed to the exit. I got what I wanted. Oh, whoops. Wrong one. Which was the crystal. So, there it is again, folks. Just saying. Dungeon 4, pretty difficult, but we made it. And now we've got we've got we're going on the dungeon five. We're so we're now um, just well, at, at dungeon five will be just about half halfway because there's four more dungeons and then the final dungeon right where you have to you know get the uh, what the heck is that guy's name? Um, it was Death Adder, yeah. But you have to get the golden axe first and all that stuff. But whew, dungeon four. All right, let's go. Let's get out of here and get to the uh, the Desert Palace uh, Hotel. We've got 20 coins to stay at the end, but we don't need the end. We're just going to save and be done. Ouch. Don't even care that I'm taking damage. All right, cool. Got that through. Getting run through here. Run through there. Sneak by that. There we go. There we go. Actually, I kind of want to know what's in that other thing. Let's go, let's go investigate this real quick. There's this guy here. What's in here? Got anything cool in here? Ooh. Some magic oil is in the treasure chest, but... Um, I already had it, so we put it back in the chest. Okay, so there's a magic oil there, in case we need it as a magic oil. I, I could have sworn it was like, if you use it, you get all your magic back, but I guess, I don't know, what does it lock you? You can't use it in battle? I gotta look that up. Um, if it is, then that's annoying, because if I had known that before, I would have, I don't know, made other choices, I guess. All right. All right. Still one heart remaining. It's fine. Boom. Do you want to save your game? Yes, I do. In that file, game data was saved. Boom. There it is, folks. We got through Dungeon 4. We made it all the way back to the Desert Temple. The next thing is Dungeon 5, for which we will, we will then go and look at the guide uh, for next time. But for now, Let's go to the wrap-up and uh, see what we got. Oops. I don't know why those played. I might actually, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to edit those out or not. I might just leave them in. G again, it's Monday. It's Monday. You guys got to give me, give me something. Um, but yeah, so we got to go find Dungeon 5. I think Dungeon 5 is up here. There it is. The Swamp Palace. All right. Flame Face. Flame Face. Look at that. Flame Face. That's where we're going for. Look at this dungeon, though. This is it's pretty beefy. We'll be all right. And what's our dungeon treasure? The dungeon treasure is Speed Shoes. That's pretty cool. We'll get to check those out. Speed Shoes. Uh, next time. And, um, yeah. After you defeat the boss, a bridge will appear on the overworld, leading you to the east half of the overworld map. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna actually like unlock new areas of the game when we beat this dungeon, uh, which is awesome. So we'll check that out next time. We're we're probably gonna be prepping uh, to go to Dungeon Five, of course. There's gotta be something, something to guide. In order to get here, you have to do this and this and this and this. You know, you know, you know the drill. So until then, 
We'll catch you next time for some good times. This one was a wild one and a crazy one. Sorry about all the weird wackiness and Atari VCS things popping up and I don't know, whatever. Um, but we got through the dungeon. That was the most important part. We've got that fourth crystal. We're going for more. All right, guys. We'll catch you next time for some good times. I'm Rich. We will see you later. All right. Take it easy, guys. Take it, ice cream, dot com.